Earthrock here, and today I'm going to be playing a map by Hooded Sniper 177. So, right off the bat, we can go ahead and just tell you that uh, the FX kind of bogged down um, the FPS, mainly this like whole cloudy thing going on right there. Uh, I feel like you could edit that a little bit, just take some of that away, but I get the effect you're kind of going towards, but if you're going to be staring out here, it's, uh, it's a little bad. So, one thing I kind of noticed is that there's different pistols. Because I did, like, come in here for, like, two seconds of recording and it's fine. But whatever. Uh, I want to check this out because it is a decent map from the looks of it. But I'm going to go ahead and figure that out. Is it a decent map? Does it have a lot of problems? We don't know. But the fact is, is that it looks like it has a lot of effort into it. And I'm really loving this custom HUD. It looks like Black Ops 1. I guarantee it's Black Ops 1 inspired. But um, I really do love it, dude. It looks really nice. Wow. Dang, that's kind of loud. Uh, one thing I would say is the ambient noises. I feel like you could do a little bit more with this. It feels kind of quiet, but then, like, hearing the zombies, it feels a little loud. Uh, I'm probably going to have to turn down my volume, <laughs> but it's fine, honestly, because I can just turn it down in the video. So I'm not going to waste your guys' time. So this is 750 We're already at $1,500. Uh, the, the price is decent, okay? I don't see any wall weapons. Um, but I think the price is decent enough to where we don't have to worry about it, especially the layout. Ooh. So I do apologize for the low FPS. Black Ops 3 isn't going to be the best of the best when it comes to FPS, but it's okay, man. Ooh. Okay, so we're going to have to go in here and check this out for 750 Oh, God, this is a dark room. Ah. I don't know why lighting is so hard for certain people. I'm just literally clinging to this for warmth and actual comfort to the lights no but this is pretty cool having multiple entrances that's nice but that that is a beautiful visual right there okay props to that Ooh, what a sexy little window so let's go ahead and just buy this gun m1 grand in order to assess this weapon's capabilities and again uh i've used these sky ports before it's the porter's fault for certain things uh, but I would go ahead and tweak the anim times on this, like first rays and stuff like that. Because it is kind of ridiculous when you have to wait super long. Like right there, just reloaded. So that's not your fault, but you can actually go ahead and fix that. So hopefully you do that. Uh, your round sounds, I believe, are a little bit too loud in my opinion compared to everything else. But let's go ahead and check this out. Ooh. You know, Alright, so he's got those classic World at War type shaders. That's nice. <laughs> it's pretty nostalgic right there. But anyways, it looks like we have a soul box. I like how it's actually identifiable. He's using Harry's soul box right there. Oh, wait, hold on. We got a part. Oh, okay, I see. I want to make sure that like I know what I'm looking at before it disappears. I honestly don't know what the hell that was. It looked like maybe a piece of flesh, but we're gonna find out. Oh yeah, soul box. Let's go ahead and feed this bad boy. Yeah, see that reload speed, man. You have to go in and ape and toggle that yourself because that is that is super annoying. How I have to wait that long just to do a reload. Oh man, look at that. Okay, that was actually a really epic max ammo. I know a lot of people don't really know how and don't really expand upon that, but dude. That was that was pretty nice. I, I just love seeing things like that, man. Oh, warms my testes. Okay, come on, zombies. Get a little closer. So the radius is actually pretty small. Um, I would prefer the radius to be a lot bigger. I don't know. Let's, let's actually see how far this is. Yeah, it's, it's pretty small. A little too small for my taste. Somewhat of a decent size, but you got you gotta turn that up a bit. Okay, but I heard a, a 115 rock. Let's be quiet for a second. Look around. It is super dark in here. All right, so we got the Guer 43 600. Let's go ahead and buy that. We'll find something far superior. Ugh. Oh, so this is a barrier. It's pitch black though. Why is that pitch? I mean. Black Ops 1 vibe, but 
I, I don't think it should be that dark with how dark this already is. It's a, it's a little uncomfortable and it makes it a little bit harder to identify when the boards are off that that even is a barrier. Oh, hold on. Okay, so I found the teddy bear. Yeah, this this is so dark, and I apologize uh, for the viewers. I might just have to turn on my brightness, but this is this is unacceptably dark. And I know a lot of people face problems like that, but you need to you gotta work on the lighting, man. Ah. I do like this right here. This little <laughs> I don't even know what this is. It's almost like a catwalk, but. I mean, it doesn't seem like it really goes anywhere, but it's still really nifty. A nice little camping spot. That's that's well thought out. I like that. It's just a place to go. I like that. You must ascend from darkness. That's that's creative. I love that. Right, so, woo! Yeah, you can and the fall damage is just perfect to where you're gonna be fine. Oh, Shnikes did not see that zombie. Let's go ahead and throw some nades, and then we'll go look for a door. One thing I want to test really quick. Okay. I didn't see anything, but I was trying to make sure there was no missing textures. Oh, spanky panky. We got a crawler. Okay. Let's go ahead and take this advantage. Uh, I don't think that's actually a map that we can use. It's just a detailed map, which is nice, though. It's pretty much a world map so this is 750 i'm gonna actually gonna start exploring oh my this is too dark okay i don't mean to be a dick about this but dude this is this is really freaking dark like do you not see this this is that's way too dark i'm on zero brightness but that is that's too dark 0.18 i i shouldn't even be able to turn it up that is that is so bad, okay? You, you gotta you gotta experience with your stops, okay? Really play around with that. I'm sorry, but you really need to improve your lighting. Oh my god, I can't I can't see where I'm going. And this is this is still a work in progress, so <laughs> just please, please improve the lighting. I don't, I don't mean to tear you apart on that dude, but that, that's a serious thing. And I know you notice it. Oh. If you need uh, tips or anything, please comment down in the description below, and I will help you on that. Or we can get together in Discord, but dear god! Fuck, this is so dark! I feel like Velma from Scooby-Doo walking around like, where's my glasses? Dear lord. Okay, but I really. I know who you are. <laughs> I'm glad he put in the custom audio codes. But I'm looking around, and it looks nice. Okay, like I really can't. I mean, as hard as it is to fucking see, I do like some of the detail. That's actually a really nice wall rip. And... The detail is nicely placed, though. So there's a thousand. Okay, I'm buying this Thompson. I will pay for this with Screw the goer. <laughs> Okay, this seems like a dead end right here. What is that? Okay, that's, uh, yeah, you gotta fix that, man. It, this just shows me that you're not playtesting it enough, because, I'm sorry, but... Oh, that's a cool little double points. Still following somewhat of the Nostra and Tone vibe. Staying consistent with the theme, I like that. Consistency is key. So we have a thousand door. Let's actually go ahead and push a little bit forward. Oh, that's cool. We have the original minigun. However, um, you need to actually tweak it in Ape so that it is infinite ammo. And you should probably edit the actual icon of it to be consistent as well. I really like that. That's that's pretty well done. And even the freaking icon, man. Dude, that, that is awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and give that up. So this is 750. There's no other door that I can see. God damn, it's so dark. Okay, so there's an Olympia right there. Honestly, 
I feel like that might be a bad place for the Olympia. You may not even need it. Uh, definitely buff the Gur a little bit, but honestly, that's your decision because it is pretty close to start. Uh, I don't, I don't really think you would need to. Oh, MP5K. Okay, this M1A1 Carbine is actually- Oh god! Oh god! Okay, it's actually really good. But, I'm gonna need that fully automatic, man. Sometimes I tire okay, shit, 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 shit. Oh! Oh! It's too dark. I can't I can't see where the zombies are coming from, man. Okay, this is uh there's a lot of effort in the mapping, but he's not playtesting enough. I don't care what you say, man. You you're not playtesting enough, or at least you are playing on some really high ass brightness. Ah. Oh, that is that's a short video. Everything is so loud. I feel like I have to scream in my mic, but um I would say please improve upon this so I can revisit it um But yeah, man. Oh and it crashed. Oh I will see you guys in the next one Please 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 improve and fix the map I, I, It's not playable That's not playable